At five, I told you about a new grant project between the city of Niles and YSU. They want to upgrade the parks in Niles, specifically Stevens Park. But it was just two days ago the bathrooms were vandalized and it wasn't for the first time. I spoke to the mayor and the park director about how this park is worth the time and energy. I don't know. I just feel sad. And then it's just disappointing that somebody would tear up um, property that doesn't belong to them. On Wednesday, the restrooms and concession stand at Stevens Park were vandalized and spray painted. We've already have some footage of the young people that were in the park and we're hoping to question them and see, you know, if they saw something. The Niles Police Department released this video of the suspects from Wednesday's incident, and this wasn't the first time that this has happened. You can see where we painted at one time somebody did graffiti. So we painted something, but then they did this again the other night. Bob Burke is the park director in Niles, and he says part of the grant money they are hoping to get through a partnership with YSU will go toward more security. Our goal is to add the surveillance cameras, add the lighting, because if it's visibly seen by people, most likely people won't go in there and vandalize stuff. Mayor Steve Minkowitz and park goers are on the same page. We would want to provide some surveillance, so you know, people to try to deter people from from doing this. And if we do catch them, you know, we're, we're going to be heavy on them. They need more lighting and they need more surveillance. On top of the increased security, Burke wants to upgrade the playground equipment to make it more modern and wheelchair accessible. It's becoming an outdated piece of equipment. And so we're hoping that um, modernizing and, and upgrading this equipment will um, will allow us to have more people to come visit our park. But Burke says he'll keep it clean for residents no matter what. Oh, to get this graffiti off, there's a chemical called graffiti remover. So I'm, I'm purchasing it, and then we're just going to have to scrub it, you know, elbow grease. And for both Burke and the mayor, these upgrades are about a safe, clean, and fun place for the community so, they say you know, deserves we, it. We partner with our neighbors, our residents, and our school, and, and they love to have a beautiful park to participate in. And with the help of this grant, they will. Surveillance video is on WKBN.com. Just give the Niles Police Department a call if you recognize anyone in that video.